kind of goes neutral corner. I tell you to go to remain that tie, call you out. Any questions over here? Any questions over here? Fight fair, fight hard. Touch gloves. And here we have it. Ariel Sepulveda versus Brad Mountain. Two big boys. And Ariel has been really prolific lately. Yeah, he's been a fighting lot. a lot lately. Oh, and Brad is quick. Yeah. He wouldn't expect it. No fear in either one of these no. guys. They came to bang. Nice knee. A little bit of a bulldog tackle there, but uh, yeah. he caught the knee and he pushed him off. It's legal in Muay Thai. Right. Chris Wagner warned him for pushing a little bit, but it was still okay. His knee seems to be finding a really good home. Let's see if it makes an effect. Big oh. left, big, big left. left. Oh, and they are tied. Yeah. Brad, Brad keeps putting his head down when Ariel's coming in. That's dangerous. Brad's a shorter fighter. He's putting his head down on those shots. Ariel might pick that knee up and hit him right in the face. And Ariel's doing a really good job there, like setting up that left yeah. shot to the body. I'll give it to Brad Mountain. He didn't want to take the break. Yeah, you don't he want to take the break. Go. Wagner made him take a break. Yep. He wanted to work through it. Again, that's the heart, man. Yep. Fighter's heart. Like I said before, you know, these guys are supposed to be wearing steel cups. Yep. And that was a straight knee, so, you, you know, it does hurt. But you have to fight through it. This is a fight. Nice elbow. Good elbow by Sepulveda. Followed by the knee. And yeah, Brad Mountain's just walking into he's things gotta now. Keep he's just his rushing. Head up, yeah. Oh. Good right hand on Sepulveda. Yeah. I'm He's doing a good job at throwing those combinations. And like we said earlier, we talked earlier about being a taller fighter, using your range. Sepulveda is doing just that. He's using his range with those hands, and he's setting it up to get those knees and those elbows. Oh. Whereas Brad Mountain's just kind of rushing in. Doesn't seem like Brad has much of a plan, whereas Sepulveda definitely has a plan, and he's executing it well. He's just picking his shots. He's picking his shots. This is textbook picking your shots by Supple Holder. Always sportsmanlike conduct. Yeah. One of the hazards of trying to go that high. You know, what happens when you're throwing those kicks, when you see guys slipping a lot, their legs aren't under them. Yep, lean him back. Big Ooh, left hook on big, from Sepulveda. Big chin on on, on Yeah, I mean, he ate that full on. Uh, yeah. Didn't phase him at all. And see, this is where Brad Mountain could do some work. Get in the clinch as a shorter fighter and just start working. But... I don't know if Brad Mountain necessarily has the skill or the gas to do that at this point. He seems a little bit tired already. He's starting to invest a lot into that overhand right. Yeah. Brad Mountain's a tough fighter, but Ariel's, yeah, yeah, yeah Ariel's. Ariel is more skilled and tough and in shape. And those knees are starting to have an effect. Yeah. Brad Mountain just doesn't know how to clinch, it looks like. And that's what just happened. Saw it right there. 
He's crossing his arms in the clinch. He's, he's, he's not getting his hips in. He's not doing the work. He's not swinging the knees. And that one landed and got an eight count for it. And Sepulveda knows it now. So he, now his game plan has slightly changed from picking him apart to getting in on that clinch and hitting those knees because that's what's working really well for him. Beautiful, beautiful, mm -hmm. long, powerful yeah. knees. And Wagner, of course, Wagner ball. steps in, rightfully so. This is the two, one more count. In New York, there is a standing eight count effect. In traditional Muay Thai, there is no standing eight count. What that means is that the referee will not stop the fight to count you out. But in New York, you can do that, and that was the right call by Wagner. Yep. And there's those big knees. You hear the crowd behind us yelling, Brad, suck it up. Oh. Big left elbow coming across there. Oh. Brad's covering, he's cowering. Wagner calls an end to the fight. Oh, no, 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 no. And he should. Brad, Brad yep. is just getting beat up. Into the second round, we have our winner by technical knockout, Ariel Zapulido!